Africa. I'm talking to two of the biggest sports stars in the world. They're joining me right now. How are you, gentlemen? It's such a pleasure to welcome you both. Thank you for being here. Thanks, James. Lewis, love seeing you, obviously. Yeah, great to see you. What is it that propels you on to just keep going and keep breaking records that you already set? Probably when I was younger, subconsciously, there were certain, there were goals. The first step was just getting to Formula One, and then the next was, okay, I'm here, I would love to get there, and then you know, I reached that point, and then it's what was next. And that early journey is kind of, it's about your mission. And then um, you're very, very much kind of your soul kind of goal. But then when you get, for me, when I've got further along, realize I'm a part of a huge team of over a thousand people, how can you elevate? How can you lift other people? And it's a strange process going from being young in your teens where it's all about your success to then seeing it being about a, a larger group. I think the love of what I'm doing and then the willingness to continue to learn and to improve is what is really the most enjoyable. Ultimately, I was always trying to be my best not the best. Let's talk about superstitions, okay? Tom, did you did did you ever have it? Did you ever have superstition? I didn't. I had a sequence of how to get so I was getting dressed, right sock first, left sock, all this these steps that I would take. And I remember I got in the car, I was in Germany, and I'm about to start the race and my helmet wasn't done up. So I've missed one of those elements of this this these steps that I had made crucial to getting the job done. And I remember I crashed. You know, several several seconds later, and um, after that, I was like, "This is ridiculous. This is all in my head." I think we create, we probably create those things in our minds. Tom, yes or no answer? Seven rings, greatest of all time. Are we going for? Are we going for number eight? Yes. Lewis, seven world championship titles, equaling the best of all time. Are we going for number eight? I've got to follow up, Tom. Yes. How do you think either of you would fare in each other's sports? I got the most beautiful gift. And you know what I realized? It doesn't fit. <laughs> How can I be a driver when the helmets don't fit me? <laughs> well, th that is a, that's a hell of a gift. So hang on, Tom, are you going to replay this? Are you going to send Lewis an NFL helmet? I'm going to send him one of mine, and I'm going to see how he likes it. <laughs> but I think we could get Lewis in there for a few plays. I think he, he, I've seen his athletic ability. He's pretty talented in a lot of areas. I think he could do some things on the football field. I would run the opposite way. Seeing those, those, those guys, the, the, the size that they are, no, nah, I don't know if I could do 